Way 31's Xavier Wary joins us live outside the Madison County Sheriff's Office tonight. Xavier, how would this loss of money have impacted the Sheriff's Office? Nikhil, Dan, the loss of revenue comes from the fact that pistol permits, they are no longer required. And you know, that's going to affect the Madison County Sheriff's Office in a numerous of ways, from training all the way down to the equipment that they are able to purchase. In the Sheriff's Office, they tell me that this new grant money is going to be a big time boost for them. We're very lucky and we're very appreciative to have uh, the people to stand up for local law enforcement, especially in this day and time. A recent agreement between the Madison County Commission and the Alabama Department of Economic Community Affairs for a new grant helps ensure the sheriff's office is not out the money that they will lose due to the new pistol permitless carry law. Being equipped with equipment in this day and time is not something that is cheap. It's very expensive, but you've got training, You've got equipment, you've got vehicles, so we are very appreciative. According to Sheriff Kevin Turner, his office could lose anywhere between six hundred and fifty and seven hundred thousand dollars a year due to the new law. However, the department is expected to receive sixty thousand dollars for the first quarter, which will help provide them money to train their deputies properly. Anytime a deputy is hired, um, you know we. Before they're cut loose on the street, we make sure that they receive every available resource that we have to put them where they're at. Now, Patterson says that this new money will not only help the sheriff's office uh, accommodate their needs, but it will also help make sure that the citizens of Huntsville and Madison County are protected. We are reporting live tonight in Huntsville. I'm Xavier Waring with 31 News.